Hello, I'm MaxH, and today we're learning all about bees. Bees are the cutest mob in Minecraft. If you agree, subscribe to my channel for more bee videos. Bees are fragile insects and have 10 hearts. You can find bees in many biomes, but the best place to get them is in the meadow biome. This is because any tree in the meadow biome has a guaranteed 100% chance of spawning a beehive. But if you can't find a meadow biome, that's okay. You can get bees another way. Just take some oak, birch, or mangrove saplings and plant them next to any flower. Let the saplings grow for a 5% chance of spawning beehives. Repeat until you get bees. Up to three bees can fit in the same hive. Their daily routine is collecting pollen, fertilizing plants, and bringing back honey to their beehive home. Once this process happened five times, you will see a visual effect of honey dripping from the nest. That means it's ready for you to collect. Bees are usually gentle creatures, but they still can get angry if you mistreat them. Doing things like breaking their hive, stealing their honey, or accidentally hitting a bee are all going to make them really mad and they're going to sting you. You must avoid this because after a bee stings you, it dies. So as a bee farmer, you do not want this to happen to your bees. Instead, you can use the trick known by all professional bee farmers. Put a campfire underneath to smoke the bees out, and now you can safely collect. Right click on a beehive with a glass bottle if you want honey or shears if you need honeycomb. Honey is a great food item you can also use in emergencies to purge negative effects, just like milk. You can also take the whole hive with you back to your farm if you have a tool with silk touch. If one hive isn't enough for you, or if you don't have silk touch, that's still okay. You can craft your own beehive using wooden planks and honeycombs to make as many as you want. But don't forget, these beehives do not come with bees inside. For that, you're gonna have to breed them. To breed bees, you need at least two to start. Then, just gather them together and feed them flowers, and they will quickly create a baby bee. The cooldown between breeding is five minutes before you can do this again with the same bees. Also, if you want the new babies to grow up fast, you can also feed them flowers. Bees just really love flowers. Bees have tiny wings and can't fly very high. All they can do is hover a few blocks above the ground. Bees also take damage from water, so keep your farm away from the ocean. Usually, bees will not travel more than 22 blocks from their hive. They prefer to stay near home, but if there's no flowers nearby, they may venture a bit further. When you think of arthropods, you think of spiders. But bees are actually also arthropods. So they also take more damage from the bane of arthropods enchantment. On top of that, they're also the only arthropod mob that can exist when Minecraft is in peaceful difficulty mode. So while you could one-shot bees with their bane of arthropods diamond sword, they don't deserve that because all they want to do is be friendly and make honey. Killing baby bees doesn't even drop anything so you're just being evil for no reason. If you somehow anger a bee, the best thing to do is run away in a straight line. They'll be angry for a while and chase you, but after 25 seconds, they will calm down and go back to normal. In case you find yourself in a situation where you can't run, your next best option is to dive into deep water and hold your breath as long as possible. You're going to take some drowning damage before the bees forget about you but that is preferable to being stunned to death. Bees can pollinate any flower, even with the roses, but sadly this hurts and kills them. And that's it for all about bees. Thanks for watching and drop a like if you learned something. Here's some bonus blooper content.